Hello YouTube, it's FSP here. The boys and I are in the shed. It's 10 o'clock at night, 10.30ish. Uh, we got the doors closed, trying to keep the bugs out of the shop, out of the shed. Uh, I know I discussed it the other day in the birthday stream, but uh, cordage is something that's very, very important. Uh, and I can't stress to you how important it is to have plenty of cordage. Uh, in different types, you know, uh, so I thought I would do another video on that. Like I said the other day, uh, can be made in the field if you have that skill, but it is very, very, very time consuming. So, uh, a brand new thing with number 36 bank line. I like the Texas bushcraft kind. Uh, I live in the South. I like to support businesses in the South. Uh when possible but uh you know bank line and the reason why bank line the sun down here will kill cordage um 550 cord for instance the sun will kill it and it diminishes in its strength uh pretty quick the sun is so hot here so Bank line, this is another thing, number 36 bank line is one I've been using. Uh, bank line is dipped in tar, it, it's twisted. There's three different little tiny threads in there that's been twisted together. Uh, the tarred bank line holds up in the southern sunshine. Uh, it will diminish over time, but you're talking a year or two, or maybe even longer. Uh, that's why this stuff is used a lot in hotter climates in the south most especially uh, So bank line definitely keep plenty of that on hand 550 cord Some of this is Walmart 550 cord the brand new thing there uh, Different size Hanks, you know uh, Smaller Hanks bigger Hanks. This is actually 1100 cord. I guess it's 550 cord on steroids uh, more bank line this is number 12 was a smaller size uh, you know string uh, it's cheap it's available I think I found this in the hardware section of Walmart can be used for certain things so a little bank a little, little thing of bank line I found this in the dump down there had some string on it so I saved that uh, this is jute twine, can be used for cordage, uh, it's really similar to baling twine, except most of your baling twines today are plastic, or plastic coated, uh, but uh, the old timey baling tw twine was just like this, natural cordage, uh, can be used for uh, fire starting as, as a tender source, you can, you can distress this out and uh, start it with a ferro rod. Uh, this right here is 100% uh, thread, uh, no not thread, cotton twine, and uh, it has its uses, it's a weak cordage, but it can be used for like um, uh, wicks, you know, if you're making candles, you can make ca uh, candle wicks with this stuff here, so it has its usage. Thread, good to have some OD green and some black thread, you know. In case you need to make some repairs on some things. Uh, that's another little bank. Uh, no, that's uh, 1100 cord there. Mule tape. This stuff holds 1800 pounds. This is what your uh, your cable people use to run cables through the walls and uh, stuff like that. Uh, I have a connection. I can get all of this bank line I want. I have a friend who works for AT&T and... They use this stuff a couple times and throw it away, and I'm like, bring it to me, dude. So, bank, uh, not bank line, mule tape can be useful. You can make uh, hammocks out of something like this, you know, it would work. So, again, wanted to reiterate how important it is to have cordage on hand. This is just what I had in this bucket. You can see right here. Some uh, some little round pieces I was using for uh, Prusik knots or whatever. 
this doesn't even count what I have in my bags, what I have uh, at in caches at the bug out location, different places. So good to stock up on cordage. You really should. If you, if you don't have at least this much, you need to be buying some. Because if the stores went down t tomorrow, would you have enough? That's the question. So uh, thank y'all for watching. It's FSP and the boys hanging out late night shed stuff. We'll check y'all later. Bye-bye.